Mmm, it's a orange juice. Today we're gonna do something a little different. We're gonna head to LA to do something special. We're in LA now and the boys at Tribe invited me to the team house. We'll get there super fast in one of these. This is a 2019 GTR. Zero to 60 in 2.7 seconds. Give yourself two seconds to think about that. With its twin turbocharged V6 front and mid engine, boasting a power output of 600 horsepower. been stuck in traffic for two hours now it's ridiculous so we're gonna grab some food on the way to the house we're gonna get Korean barbecue because ah, Google We are stuffed. That was a really good meal, but it's time to head to the team house. We're in LA. What better thing to do than to do influencer things? Well, that was really fun being an influencer for a minute, but let's get back to business and head to the team house. Finally at the tribe house, we've traveled thousands, millions of kilometers to get here. I think it says miles now, but we're not really gonna do the house tour. We just got this house. So everyone's kind of unpacking. So let's just do some interviews. My name is Jay Monty, and my favorite thing about being on the tribe team is just all my great teammates, the managers, everything from John to Pat. Um, everyone just works super well together, and I like that a lot. We know how to laugh, which I think is important and so a lot of times we're just having fun when we're playing. I started playing Clash Royale, I think like five days after the global launch. Um, just a couple of my friends from school showed me the game and we had all played Clash of Clans together. So I was like, okay, this looks pretty cool. It looks like a game I would play. I was already playing Clash of Clans and like other mobile games. So I just tried it. I was in their clan for about three months. And then I realized that was just, you know, a tier above the rest. So I just ditched my friends and I was like, all right, let's go pro. Yeah, just like that. <laughs> Boom. Boom. 
chose it. I chose it, yeah. I stay on top of the game by playing a lot. As much as every other pro does, um, we have to make sure that we're playing every month, adapting to new metas, so, you know, new cards will become good. We just have to make sure that in the ever-changing game, we can have the best strategies. Something that most people don't know about me is that I love romance movies. My favorite experience about coming to California, probably the beach and just the great weather. I live in Pennsylvania, and so it's just kind of like rainy and not the most beautiful for like nine months out of the year. So anytime I come here, it's just a good turn. And how many times have you been to the beach? None. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you think is the best player in Tribe? I would like to say me, but at the moment, I have to say B-Rad in 1v1. Um, he's just very consistent. I mean, I'm kind of biased because I'm his 2v2 teammate, but I think he has the consistency that none of us have yet. My name is Birad, and people think I'm the best modern player in the world because of how high I finished on ladder and how consistent I am in tournaments. I love being on Tribe because of the teammates and the coaches. We just have a really fun time in the house. When Supercell first uh, released the tournaments and grand challenges, I realized I was a really good player when I started to really excel in those, got those 12 wins and finished high in the tournaments. I've actually won a million cards in grand challenges, and I have the leaderboard for the most 12 wins. Who's the best player on the team? How do I be humble at the same time? Of... <laughs> We're all pro players here, you know? <laughs> oh no, they're fighting. Uh, my favorite teammate in the house has to be Jay Monty. He just creates the most amount of shenanigans in the house. My name is Selk, and I'm the head coach for Tribe Gaming's Clash Royale division. I worked for Liquid for a, for a time. I worked for Kessel, Team Kessel for a time. And obviously I was a med, med school student and I worked in a water bottle com company. My name is OJ. I've always considered myself kind of like an above average player, but when it comes to the, all the pro players here, it's, it's next level. For me, I've always had a really good mechanical understanding of games and I'm just really passionate about explaining new findings for new cards and these things. So what the game has evolved over the past few years is insanely different. There's so many different aspects. Like everyone in this house has so much to teach me and it's really cool how we, I'm, I'm rambling. Let's just play some 2v2 with b Rat. Are we gonna hear all that in the background? Eh, it's fine. <laughs> People <laughs> might comment about it, but you know, it's good. <laughs> Whatever. So you have the most grand challenge wins one in the world. That is correct. Over 500 wins. A lot of grinding went, in the, went into that, yeah. I think I have like 30. So that makes you the world's best player. My calculation's correct, yeah, you're right. I'm just the best. <laughs> you, you heard it here first. He has an amazing YouTube channel, B Rat, check it out. It's gonna be in the link in the description down below. If you guys wanna see one of the best players play insane plays, learn from the best, then he's better than me. Number one grand challenge wins, it's nuts. Oh yeah. You have a skeleton deck and I have an all goblin deck. What can go wrong? All skelly, all goblin. Wait, are we even friends? Yeah. Of course we are. Yeah, well, I'm doubting that. I'll be. You've got all skeletons, I've got all goblins. How's this gonna synergize? Just don't overthink it, just, it'll work. Okay, I don't even know what's gonna happen. I have the goblin giant, you have graveyard. Mm -hmm. Everyone's gonna be happy. Mm -hmm. And I got freeze, so I'll just freeze anyway. Yeah, yeah. Max, Actually, max cards too, so that'll that's, help. That's gonna work. All right, look at my hand, this is, this is amazing. Okay, I got that. Oh, you, yep, you do. Good communication so far? Yep. <laughs> They've only got um, Goblin Gang. Yeah, you can, you can do that to bait out something. Okay. Oh my goodness, I wish I had the log or something right now. Why can the Barbarian Barrel be a Skeleton Barrel? Wait, that doesn't make sense. There is a Skeleton Barrel. Yeah, I have it right here. Oh, Hound, alright. What do we even have for a Hound? I, I have Dark Goblin, kind of. Okay. You can make this work. I'm going all in. You can do whatever you want on that side. Okay, I'm gonna. It's all you. I'm gonna it's defend. All you. Oh. Wait, I can actually defend that really well. I have Goblin Hut. Um. Yeah, I did a pretty good job defending. You did. And I'm gonna pull the minions now. Oh, that is a great defense. You don't even need me. Huh. I need to damage on the tower on the other side. I love it. Someone showed them the Goblin Giant, they just use the Infernal Tower, so maybe we can do something with that. Yeah, yeah. okay. We're gonna rush it then. Oh my goodness, they have Mini Pekka. Of course they... Nice! Nice, nice, nice. Um, yeah, you can do that. I got that. Okay. I'm just gonna take care of the Princess then. 
Come on, giant skeleton. Why'd you have to die? I feel like the goblin cage isn't good for anything right now. It's only level 8. I don't want to use it. Even if it was max level, what would you... <laughs> pull, pull a lava hound, maybe? The hut's so much better for that. Yeah, I'm gonna wait until I'm full elixir. Hopefully they're gonna minion hard that now. I don't... I don't want to... Oh. Double, double pull here. Okay, yeah, yeah that works. Did they just wreck my Dark Goblin? Oh goodness. That Dark Goblin was the key to the... Oh, no. No, I might have panicked. Yo, I'm I'm still, okay, uh, put a Goblin Drive behind that if you have enough elixir. Behind the giant skeleton? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Good freeze, I can feel it. Yep. Oh my goodness, a skeleton barrel? That scar me actually connected. Oh, big damage. Only if there's like a goblin rocket spell. Wait. Goblin rocket spell. My rocket has a goblin on top of does it. Does that count? Does, does that count? I think that counts. That, you, should, you should put it in. We need some damage. Totally. The princess is so annoying. We don't have a log. I just want a goblin cage right? You know what, I'm just gonna stop a bomb tower on Did you pull that with the... Yeah, yeah, perfect, perfect. I'm gonna stop some of that, because I don't think you're too much damage. Okay. Make a graveyard freeze, this is... This is the way to win. Oh, we can afford that balloon going in. Oh my goodness! That Dark Goblin is gonna... That Dark Goblin is wrecking. Did they just see the log? Yep. Oh, I meant to do my Goblin Barrel. Oh, that, that's gonna work. It's gonna work. Either way. Good game! I cool. All, all, all skeletons, all wow. goblins. I love it. Changing up anything? I think the goblin rocket will work better than the goblin cage. Round two. I, I just love rushing in with the goblin barrel. All right, I got a freeze hovered. This is... Ooh, they both... Don't speak of that again. I keep misplaying it one tile. I'm out of my element right now. I need... <laughs> I am over committing on defense and offense. This, this is a good start. You can Dark Goblin or... Oh dear. Oh nice. Okay. Oh. I almost want to... Oh, oh. Doesn't reach. That reaches. Nice. Hopefully it stays, Skellies. Come on. Yep, yep, Come yep, on. yep, yep. Woo! You did not cheat that, that rocket. Good job. Good. What do you have? Like, I got Bomb Tower. Uh... Let it pull to the bomb. Yeah, there we go. There we Perfect. Go. Oh! Nice. Not really sure how that princess died in one shot. It usually takes two rounds. Oh, it was a level 12 princess. <laughs> okay, well, they're gonna log it. Oh, they, they just log? You want a barrel? Yeah. Oh dear. Freeze! Oh, nice freeze. One stab, two stabs. I missed one goblin. I wouldn't hit a king tower if I tried to hit all of them. No, that was okay. good. That was really good. All right. I, I think our perfect deck is working. You got all skeletons. I've got all goblins. It's if you really want it, you can you could possibly no, that'd be bad rocket. No. Nope. I can uh do this. Okay, you've got the goblin barrel. They don't have a zap. We're good. I feel like I need to start goblin something. Yeah, I haven't shown them graveyard yet. Maybe we can graveyard with this whole thing. I'm just waiting for them to log my dark goblin. Yeah. Oh no, later. Okay. Let's bomb power snipe this. Oh really? What in the <laughs> world? Oh, it that's works. a bomb tower. Come on, you don't know the strats, OJ. It works. That's oh, all. I got a Look at this. It's all gonna die. It's all gonna die. Boom. Boom. Oh, that's good. They they didn't use log of my goblin barrel. I think that is game set match. Oh my goodness. Goblin rocket win.